Ivory Coast is a well-known cocoa producer. But of late, it's now gone from being a minor player in the cashew market to becoming an exporter to be reckoned with. I was growing yams back then and wasn't earning enough. I heard people talking about a new tree you could make money growing. The crop gained popularity in the 1970s, planted to combat desertification, and since then has picked up tremendously. Now farmers and industry players are putting their heads together to discuss how to better harness opportunities presented by the business. We think that we will create many jobs and we will create added value for the country. That's why, besides strategic reforms, the focus is on the transformation. On average, output grows by 10% each year. In 2013, the country reported yields of half a million tons. This made it the world's largest export of the nut, followed by India. We have achieved a real cashew industry which absorbs a lot of labor, so it reduces poverty. This is the case of Vietnam when it came out of eight years of war. It developed an industry that has allowed many former fighters or youth to work. The association has high expectations for the industry. According to research, the association anticipates that by 2020, at least 35% of the country's raw cashew output will be processed locally.